Hello everyone and welcome back. Today I want to show you how to make easily your own napkins fitting to your Easter dinner with your family and friends. Therefore, I designed a little vector file by myself. If you also want to use this file, you can download it on our website. If you have seen our father videos, you might already know how to load a vector data into Basepack. So I will keep it short here. Import the vector data into a new Basepack file. You might see that my vector file is not optimal for a good embroidery result. That's why I don't use the ACE function here. Change the size of your vector data. Make sure that the lock is closed here, so that the pattern remains proportional in size. Start digitizing. Think about which parts of the design will be in the back, which one will be on top. Are there any parts you can connect with a running? The advantage of our vector file is that we can select the contours with the eyedropper. Like I mentioned before, the vector file is not optimal for a good embroidery result, so I will change the contours a little bit by myself. As a frame for embroidery, I will use one of the mighty hoop frames. I clamp my napkin easily with the hoop master station. The two rings of the outer contour hoop hold the garment with magnetic force. I don't need to adjust them. In addition, after finishing my embroidery, no marks remain visible. 
If you are interested in the Hoopmaster and Mighty Hoops, look at our frame catalog or contact us. Load your design into your machine. Be sure to check your pantograph configuration. Does your current machine equipment match to the blue marked setting? If not, you can simply change it by using the cursor keys. You don't see the pantograph configurations? Then check your software settings. If you do not have any pattern open, you can also change the configurations here. To make the design even easier to place, there is the possibility to equip our ZSK machines with a cross laser positioning. The cross will show you the starting point of your design. Turn the cross laser on and start to positioning your design. Don't forget to turn off the cross laser when you finished the positioning. Thank you for watching. Please feel free to contact us and to follow us on Instagram.